It's that time of year again to grab your ballet shoes, take out those froofy tutus, and get ready for the Nutcracker. Since 2005, a number of ballet students have been working with the Flagstaff Symphony Orchestra to put on this marvelous performance. Because every year we have a different group of student children performing. They start when they're young and each year they're doing a different role. So they're not doing, they never do the same part year after year, but they are doing different roles. So I have different, different dancers and doing each of the roles like the Sugar Blum Fairy or the Snow Queen. Or, that all alternates every year. So it's really interesting for me to see that progress. I think this is my fifth year doing the Nutcracker. It's more exciting. It gets more exciting every year with every part and it's always different. Well, it's definitely a tradition and it's something like all the dancers like really look forward to each year because like the what part they're going to get and all that. Some notable scenes to look out for are the Cordobelli scenes, also known as group scenes, like the Waltz of the Flowers and the Snow scene, as Andrew describes the music and scenes to be both powerful and beautiful. The, the music is wonderful. Uh, I think I, probably my favorite part of Nutcracker is the music. It's, it's wonderful music by Tchaikovsky. I guess my favorite part about being in the Nutcracker is performing. It's just very exhilarating, like the thrill you get when you perform. But I also love becoming a character and becoming like part of this whole ballet to create it. It's just a great opportunity for our students to dance with the Flagstaff Symphony Orchestra in Nutcracker and, and doing a full-length ballet, so they're very lucky. These talented young women will take the stage on December 5th and 6th at Audrey Auditorium. For NAZ Today, I'm Kaylee Emery.